So uh, let's uh, focus on uh, e-government. Uh, we can uh, divide the whole history of e-government into several phases. First, uh, digitizing, so actually making DBs. Uh, second phase is uh, making online service uh, using such a database. Uh, third one is integrating government service. And finally, since 2013, uh, government 3.0. Uh, today's topic. I explained uh, phase one. First phase, uh, it is making a database, uh, uh, database uh, uh, critical to national operation. Second phase, the goal is to make online service using the that database. So in phase two, the Korea government applied bottom-up approach. Bottom-up approach means that each ministry of each agency had no third party or had no higher control tower. Uh, they can develop as many online services as they want. And the government encourage each agency to develop online service. Huh? So when we evaluate uh, ministries or agencies, we just count the number of online service. So we try to boom up the online service. That inevitably uh, led to duplication problems. So similar services has uh, have been developed uh, between uh, similar related agencies. So in third stage, our goal is to integrate similar services together. It, for this goal to realize, our approach was top down. Not bottom. Top down, so special committee for e-government, and the next, uh, the next administration uh, formed government reform committee. All these committees were presidential committee. That means that the committee directly reported to the president about their achievement and about uh, the problem uh, about about anything. The first effort to integrate related service uh, was 11 key initiatives. So, for instance, e-service to, to citizens, almost all agencies open their uh, uh, online service channel. So then, uh, if the government agency number is uh, 50, then there's 50 50 online uh, service uh, home pages. We put together and uh, we made it one single. E procurement system. So, e procurement, Korea is one of the first generation countries that developed uh, online procurement system. Uh, uh, it, it was 1996. So, we began to open bid online and receive uh, proposals online and decide who is take that uh, project online. Huh? We put a whole process, a pro procurement process online. It was a big success. It was very nice. The problem is that each uh, ministry developed their own <laughs> procurement system. So the companies uh, who uh, sell their product to the government have to visit uh, 50 on e procurement homepage every day. They have to uh, visit. So we integrate uh, the e procurement service uh, together. One. From 2008, uh, we begin to use smart, smart government. Our uh, our goal is a little uh, changing. So uh, in previous stage, our goal was to integrate individual system. But now our goal is to integrate not just the system level, the platform level. We try to uh, integrate the, the government platform. For instance, we have two uh, integrated computing center. So it's a little different. In previous phase, we integrate uh, individual application. Hmm? We, we integrate application, but not this time. Not, it, it is not application in this platform. We integrate platform. Mm -hmm. uh, so, our original design was to uh, start with location integration, second, hardware integration, 
soft fuel integration, and finally, service integration. So, but now you know, we use cloud. Cloud, some, uh, uh, cloud something. So you, you, you can say hardware cloud, software cloud, service cloud. It's the same meaning. Same meaning. But our original design uh, was like this. Uh, it started when it, uh, it is 2003, 2004, maybe. Huh? It started. And uh, it is more than 10 years old project. Uh, according to our original design, our original plan, uh, Korea's uh, between location integration and hardware integration. Much, much slower than we designed. Why? Why? Uh, still, uh, agencies. So, agencies uh, put their uh, server, put their equipment uh, to this center, huh? but they want to uh, keep their ownership of their servers and equipment to make a uh, hardware integration they they give up uh, hardware ownership to make software integration uh, software ownership should be shared by the whole government agencies we did not enter this uh, stage but some case we uh, now share hardware some hardware but it's a half and half Many government issue a document, a certificate, uh, a certificate document to uh, citizen. Uh, but in order to reduce uh, a paper, a paper a certificate, so the Korean government build administration information sharing center. There's administration information sharing center. Uh, so we use the print uh, document and hand it to the citizen, and the citizen submit that document to other agency. Uh -huh. After we uh, set up this sharing center, if the citizen just uh, visit the target uh, agency, then the target agency directly check uh, the information uh, via through information sharing center. It is very efficient effective and safe, very safe.